Hi, this is One for the Record. I'm Diane, and today is May 31st, 2014. Here are your news updates for today. Uh, let's first uh, hop and skip over to BP Earthwatch. Uh, here's what he's saying. He's saying, is this the sixth seal vi uh, vial and trumpet? Euphrates blocked. Here's the question now, because I started listening to it. Um, so if Turkey has blocked all the water to Syria, and it's going to somehow, it's going to affect uh, Iraq, Iran, all the water, the Euphrates uh, levels are dropping. Are there any nuclear plants over there, feet, you know, keeping cool from, from the Euphrates? That's a big question I have. The brainiacs that are blocking the water <laughs> in Turkey, are, are, are there nuclear plants over there that might be affected by no water? Not only are there more than 7 million people in Syria have no water, basically, and the power generators, of course, by the dams will not work, but uh, what about nuclear plants? We're going to play the water game. What's going on? Aren't there nuclear plants over there in the Middle East, or am I wrong? Please, someone uh, leave a comment about that. Do you see why? Do you see why you can't have nuclear plants? Do people understand? All right, let's play a little bit of what he's saying. I'm going to skip through some of his stuff. May 31st, 2014. Guys, things seem to be moving at a rapid pace biblically in the Middle East. And let's pay attention to this. And some of you guys may have seen where they are having problems on the Euphrates River. But this is the Tishron Dam in Syria. Syria has cut this off downstream in order to maintain height. And you're looking at old ruins there, right in the middle of the Euphrates River. And what's happened is because Syria shut this down, it shut down to Iraq. Already within a two days of this report that came out yesterday, they say millions of people are <clears throat> on the verge of not having any water at all. This is a six-meter drop. And this is the dam we're looking at. And they again, they've shut this off to try to preserve water, not intentionally cutting it off from Iraq. But what's happened above Syria, Turkey has cut it off. Now, don't know how the exact, <clears throat> the, we don't know the details on their water supply. We do know there's political pressure on Syria from Turkey because of what um, Assad has been doing to his people. Okay. You've seen the ruin of Damascus. That's how close we are in pro prophecy, guys. But what, <clears throat> you're not only dealing with water, but electrical power to these people. Now, when you talk about taking people's water, you're talking about a lot of trouble as we look through this area. The army with the breastplates of iron. It's a different deal in the Sixth Seal. But let's look at just the headlines from yesterday. Turkish government recently cut off the flow of the Euphrates River, threatening primarily Syria, but also Iraq with a major water crisis. The a newspaper there found out the water level in Lake Assad has dropped by about six meters, leaving millions of Syrians without drinking water. Two weeks ago, the Turkish government once again intervened in the Syrian crisis. This time was different from anything they had attempted before, and the repercussions of which may bring unprecedented catastrophes onto both Iraq and Syria. So they're violating international norms. It goes on, you can pause this, but... <clears throat> You may want to study also who ISIS is, the Islamic State in Iraq and Syria, ISIS, and who controls some of that. Controlling the region the dam is located, it did not suspend the water output. That's what I was saying. Syria didn't, as far as just trying to block Iraq, they had no choice, and really they let it get too low before they did it. It's already affecting drinking water and possibly could cause some collapse of these dams because when you take that much pressure off that long you can have a lot of cracking just that's the same way that sinkholes form but anyway it says that the water supplies and auxiliary reservoirs and our capture are close to are close to being deleted and the reservoirs are expected to run out of water completely by tonight or tomorrow morning that was yesterday this threatens to leave 7 million Syrians without access to water. Also, Tishron Dam, that's when I was showing you stop receiving any water which blocks its electricity generating turbines. 
decreasing the power supply in Aleppo and its countryside, further intensifying the already severe imbalance in the power supply there. Now, think about it, guys. <clears throat> Your lights are turned off and you don't have any water. You think you'll fight? You'll fight or you'll die? That goes to this. Now, this is going to answer a couple of questions that I've had lately. But let's start at the top at Revelation 9, 7. It says, The shape of the locusts were, lo were likened to horses prepared unto battle. Their heads were crowns like gold, and their faces were faces of men. And I showed you those images of the popes with the, gray, with the golden crowns, guys. And it, remember, here it says, Seen that release. We saw that, whatever you want to call that uh, magic parade they gave us there in the but we what we've seen is people like the Pope sent to let's move forward an army Jackwood and brimstone this is an army and the heads of horses were the heads of lions and out of their mouths issued fire smoke and brimstone by these three were the th third part of men killed by the fire and by the smoke and by the brimstone which issued out of their mouth now the other I'm going to go into Revelation 16, but it, this answers two questions. One I had, was there 21 events we're dealing with in Revelation? Or All right, let's see. Revelation 9:14, saying to the sixth angel which had the trumpet loose the, loose the four angels which are bound in the great river Euphrates. Hmm. Well, let's keep going. Let's play. Up in the way the kings of the east might be prepared. Both times you see nine with the six uh, there. Now you've seen the sixth angel pour out his vial. Again, River Euphrates. You understand what I'm saying? There's seven events. This is how close we could be, guys said the water was there above, dried up and the way of the kings of the east might be prepared and I saw three unclean spirits like frogs come out of the mouth of the dragon and out of the mouth of the beast and out of the mouth of the false prophet for these are the spirits of devils working miracles which go forth unto the kings of the earth and of the whole world not just the middle east to gather them to the battle of the great day of God almighty then right after that, guys, the seventh angel, we know in all seven events, in all three sections of the 21 events, so many people call that. It's not. It's seven. The seventh is the day of the Lord. Okay. Well, that's what's going on right now. Be prepared for anything with that. Alrighty then, moving on. The Extinction Protocol 2012 and beyond. New study warns world is facing six... Great extinction. It's saying that the animals and the animals are dying off ten times faster than the previous extinction. But, but the other five extinctions, they didn't die off this fast. We're losing species ten times faster than we did before. Flights grounded as Indonesia's Sangang volcano erupts. Righty then. Let's go into breaking news, breakingnews.com. Let's see. Boat carrying nearly a dozen people capsized near downtown Miami. Heads up, that was three hours ago. Storm develops south of Gillette, Wyoming. Officials, six climbers feared dead after equipment found at bottom a 3,000 foot drop on Mount Rainier. Coming out of NBC News three hours ago.
plane crashes at Hanscom Field in Bedford, Massachusetts. No word of injuries. That was an hour ago. Heads up. Alrighty then. Alright, we're getting ready to go into Sunday. One day down of the weekend. One to go. Tomorrow is the first. Have your rent ready. Time for rent. Ooh, there's Max in the background. Alrighty then. Be prepared for anything. Be safe. And I'll talk to you again tomorrow on the flip side. Alrighty then.